All right, yes, we don't listen to you, but I inform it concerning the real time um, festival um, with the Shelley. June 24th for Inside Real Bodo Lagos. And we'll tell you about one of the biggest events we go actually share for Inside the Real Time um, Festival. And we talk saying that the real time filmmaking challenge, whereby they will give some filmmakers challenge to produce a short movie, a 20 minutes, um, I'll be 30 minutes? So it's 20 minutes short movie now they will actually need to um, produce. And we get. Um, and within 20 hours, they just get 20 hours to produce this short movie. And we get one of the participants, uh, we go actually participate for inside the real time filmmaking challenge. They go let us know the process and how it is very easy for them or very hard for them. They go introduce themselves one after the other, starting with the man sitting close to me. So tell us about you. Um, I am um, Daniel Okon. Okay. I'm a um, cinematographer, so I uh, work with my team. Um, so um, that's what I do, is into um, cinematography, basically. OK. Yeah, so. Very nice, cinematographer. Yeah. All right, then talk to the only lady in their midst. OK, uh, my name is Damlola Onola, and um, what I do majorly is script writing. I'm the script writer for this team. Nice one. And? OK, my name is um, Peter Binola, okay. and I'm privileged to be the director of the team. Nice one. So let's talk, a bit, before we talk about the Real Time International Film Festival, maybe we talk about um, your educational background. You now get um, a background, educational background on filmmaking before now, or it's just an interest after school? We want to just pick. Um, we actually um, went to a film school. Okay. Yeah, at um, PFT Film Institute. So um, I'm doing a stay um, in PFT, we are doing some projects short films too so and uh, once we left school we went into it because this is actually what we want to do for for a living mm, nice one yeah, so. so let me ask Dami now um short movies i know say now now nigerians they try to embrace short movies and we get a lot of filmmakers where they actually go into that particular field and just talking with you now behind the scene you talk so you don't actually get loads of short movies when i do actually produce yeah. how is the reception um, well, short movies, I think uh, it is much easier to do short movies than feature length for those of us that are just trying to break into the industry. So it's a way of um, passing our message a bit to the, to the audience. Well, are people embracing it? Now, you need to actually speak out so that people can hear you um, okay. very well. Now, are people actually embracing this in our short movies? The ones who not already get on ground, are people enjoying it? Are they watching it and being happy about it? Yes, they are. Um, after doing a short film, they like ask for more. Um, because most short films don't really like it's more it's it's not like a feature length where you yes. get to see the whole thing and everything. So they are always like curious, I want to know more, I want to see more of the short films. So let's talk about the Real Time International Film Festival. Tell us at what point you will realize, hey, come, there's an opportunity for me to showcase my talent and I need to key into this and how this particular platform do actually help to put your thinking in the right direction. Well, um, Real Time Challenge, it's uh, a challenge for us itself, according to the name. <laughs> so when I got to know about it, I was like, wow, 20 hours. Shoot a movie, edit, and submit in the space of 20 wow. hours. Well, we know. Um, what movie it's all about. Mm -hmm. Shooting a scene in a day, we know the stress Very stressful. We, we go through and they are telling us to come and shoot a short film, edit, mm. in the space of 20 hours. And we're shooting in the same location. The same location? Yes. All filmmakers are shooting in the same location. So I was like, wow, it's not something easy, but let's try something. It will work out. We can do something as a thing. I like, I like that. Now, what do you feel, say, be the intention of the organizers of the Real Time Film International Film Festival as regards to this Real Time Challenge? What was the intention? Is it to see if really you guys have been creative or what? What do you think is the intention? Um, yeah, um, being creative and um, to see uh, our level of uh, performance, our level yeah. of um, in intelligence, our, our level of uh, readiness mm. um, into uh, filmmaking. Because uh, really, filmmaking is not what you just wake up to, you want to just get into, you need to be, um, you need to be uh, passionate about it. So I think they want to see 
how passionate we are. Because uh, I'm really, uh, 20 hours to shoot, to edit, and to submit at the same time, it's uh, really um, kind of a very short time for us. But So they're trying to see how fast we can um, uh, Think. deliver um, a film. So in case they say, OK, take this um, project. Um, uh, uh, we need it in um, one week or mm -hmm. so. So, uh, so I, I think that is what they are try, trying to do. Yeah. Thank so, you. Okay. I, sorry, uh, I also think they want to see our level of creativity yeah. within that short period of time. Very nice ones. So uh, let's talk about how Natek apply for the real time challenge. How did you apply for it? Okay, uh, we did a short film while we were in school, and. Uh, what was it about? Um, it's about a young lady uh, that was suffering from um, sexual abuse mm -hmm. in society. So the producer um, put in for film uh, real time challenge festival and it was selected. Mm -hmm. So he sent it to me that our short film had been selected for the festival. I was like, wow. So I went, when I saw it, I went online to check more about them and I saw the challenge. Like, wow, there's another platform. Why the festival is going on? There's another platform for filmmakers to put in their creativity together and see what they can do. And I told the scriptwriter, can we do something? Can we work on something? And she said, 20 years, 20 years. It's difficult, but let's see what we can do. It's a trial. Yeah. It's a, uh, a theme of filmmakers. We're going to be meeting several filmmakers, shooting in the same location in the space of 20 years. Let's see what we can do. Mm. And I said, OK. Fine, if you are putting in, I mean. Nice one. We get a lot of filmmakers because Wazabia TV actually stand out for the back of the Real Time International Film Festival. So we get a lot of filmmakers actually willing to dig and dive into this 20 hours of making a short movie. Yeah. Una feel say you fit actually win this challenge. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so. yes, yes. We yes. are very sure that you can win this challenge. If yeah. we don't believe in ourselves, we won't. Put it in the first place. Very true. Yeah, so What's the catch at the end of this if we now win this challenge? What's the catch? Um, uh, after doing my research, I saw that they were going to give out certificates for different um, categories, maybe best um, female actress, male actress, and all of that. There are about nine of them. So I feel if we do very well, we could get about maybe five for it. <laughs> <laughs> Is there any monetary terms attached to it if you become no, the winner? No, 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 Just no. more exposure for yes, you. Yes, yeah. exposure. Mm -hmm. Very nice for a nice chatting with you. And we Thank wish you, you all the best in the real time challenge. And Thank I hope you. you come back as the winner. Yeah. <laughs> I hope. Yeah, so you need to yeah. write a very captivating script too. Yeah, as yes. a matographer, yeah. uh, you have to be on point. <laughs> everything. You, yeah. have to, you understand now, now yeah. to put everything together. I wish you all the best. Thank and good you. job. Thank if person want to actually watch some of your short movies, can they see it online? Or yeah, on it? YouTube, yeah. yeah what name? Um, Say it. Frank's Media. Friends Media. Yeah, All, right. Friends Media All right, very nice one. And more videos will be uploaded there. So please support them, watch their movies, and then comment and let them know that they are doing very well. Young people in the industry and they're achieving greatness. All right, and don't forget to the Real Time Festival. Go actually share that June 24th and you go work out with July 1st. So if you never had um, feel for and apply for and now, quickly, quickly log on to their website and apply to be to attend the Real Time International Film Festival. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.